Everything Dinosaur has just taken delivery of this bad boy. This is the new Spinosaurus model from PNSO, Eamon the Spinosaurus, and it arrived on the same day that a scientific paper had just been published providing more information on this amazing theropod dinosaur. Let's open the box and show you the model. So, let's take a look at the model. Here it is. This is Eamon the Spinosaurus, the latest incarnation of this dinosaur genus from PNSO. It's a beautiful model. It measures about 32 and a half centimetres long, and that intriguing sail fin is about 14 centimetres off the ground when you've supported the figure on the clear transparent support stand that comes with this figure. It's got an articulated jaw and it's beautifully painted. And it's got that broad, deep tail that has been identified in previous research, which looked at the caudal vertebra. It's a magnificent Spinosaurus model and it's available from Everything Dinosaur. And this is going to be part of my model collection. I'm going to be taking this uh, and bringing this one home. It's a superb Spinosaurus and I love the way that PNSO are reflecting some of the latest scientific research. It comes with 20 posters and a manual all about Spinosaurus and its artwork. And there is even a small model of a Spinosaurus skull included in the box. So that's the new Eamon the Spinosaurus from PNSO, available from Everything Dinosaur. Thank you. Don't forget to subscribe and to hit that notification button to be part of the conversation. Spinosaurus has been the subject of intense research over the last decade. Its mode of hunting and behaviour has come under increased scrutiny since a detailed description based on new fossil material was published in 2014 by Ibrahim et al. This paper proposed that Spinosaurus was semi-aquatic. It was an obligate quadruped. The paper presented a substantial amount of evidence to indicate that this dinosaur spent a lot of its time near water. However, the scaling of some of the bones used in the reconstruction was criticised, especially the hind limbs and pelvic region. Was Spinosaurus walking on four legs? Or was it a biped, like all the other known theropods? A paper published in 2020 described tailbones that had been found in 2018. These caudal vertebrae indicated that the tail of Spinosaurus was broad, flexible and fin-like. The researchers concluded that the tail was well adapted to propel Spinosaurus through water. Indeed, co-author of the study, Dr. David Unwin of the University of Leicester, commented, The Spinosaurus fin-like tail is a game-changing discovery for us that fundamentally alters our understanding of how this dinosaur lived and hunted. It was actually a river monster. However, in 2022, a scientific paper was published in the journal eLife. It challenged the aquatic lifestyle. Paleontologists led by scientists from the University of Chicago argued that Spinosaurus aegyptiacus and Baryonyx walkeri would have been unstable when surface swimming. They also concluded that these dinosaurs would be too buoyant to dive and remain fully submerged. Also in 2022, another assessment by Fabry et al using a statistical analysis of bone density, proposed that Spinosaurus could dive and stay submerged. The heavy bones they identified acting like ballast. This anatomical adaptation is seen in extent birds, such as penguins, and also in some mammals, like manatees. In March 2024, a study was published that criticised the complex statistical methodology used in the bone density paper. 
it was concluded that the earlier research undertaken by Fabry et al. had measurement errors and was flawed. Inconsistencies in measurement made it difficult to infer an aquatic lifestyle for Spinosaurus. This dinosaur is likely to intrigue scientists for many more years. The lack of an articulated and more complete fossil specimen representing a single individual is hampering research. However, this new PNSO Spinosaurus figure broadly reflects the current scientific thinking.